structured cabling testing, why you should insist on structured cabling testing and what you should insist on. How do you test a data cable? A data cable can be tested in a variety of ways. However, with structured cabling testing, there are certain standards and reports that should be insisted. Otherwise, you will not know that the data cabling installed is actually working or will support the hardware it is supporting for data cabling transmission. Multimeter. This will test individually for continuity that connector 1 goes to connector 1 at the other end. This is an unsuitable test as it doesn't test for any performance standards. Network Cable Tester, Mod Tap Device. This device will plug the data cable in each end and check all eight connectors are connected correctly end to end with no shorts or breaks. However, it will not test for performance or interference. Cable Certification Testers, Level 3 Testers. The first two testers will cost under £100. In contrast, a certification tester will be priced in the thousands thereby showing that the level of testing is vast and a lot more technical. What is a level 3 tester or cable certification tester? These testers will test the data cabling links to provide operational assurance. In this instance by testing a unique set of network tests to a certain standard of tests and requirements. These are the only tools that give you guaranteed pass or fail results after the tester tests to a certain set of industry standards. Subsequently, this can be a test to a certain regulatory body or for a specified category of cable. It will tell you if the installed CAT6 cable is operating to the correct standard. Furthermore to the specifications of that category of cable and not just connected correctly. How do you test a data cable with a cable certification tester? The testing unit will have a main unit and a remote head. The units are plugged in either end of a structured cabling link and then an operational test will be run down the cable and back along it for analysis. A few examples of the tests it carries out are Length, how long the installed cable is and is it within the 100 meters max? Wire map, are all eight cores wired correctly with no shorts and crossovers? Attenuation, the reduction in signal loss along the data cable. Next, interference from the transmitted signal coupled back. DC lock resistance, total resistance of two conductors at one end of a link. Return loss, loss of power in the signal which is returned or reflected. Structured cabling testing, reasons to have your installation tested. Firstly if it's not tested you won't know if the installer has. 1. Terminated the data cabling correctly end-to-end. -end. 2. Terminated the network cabling correctly in the right methods. 3. Additionally terminated the structured cabling to the correct standards. Secondly, not all cabling terminations are equal. Poor terminations can result in the following. 1. Slower network speeds, i.e. only running at 100 megabytes instead of 1 gigabit. 2. Interference on the data cable. 3. Interference onto neighboring data cables. 4. Dropouts, i.e. phone calls drop or lost connection to servers. Structured cabling testing checks that the correct patch panel ports go to the correct data module location. If the system isn't tested this issue won't be highlighted by the data cabling installer to rectify. Your system is then unusable from a management perspective. Finally, you have accountability. If you receive test results, it shows at a point in time that everything was installed correctly. Therefore working to the specified standard. This eliminates the blame culture later on. Furthermore testing checks that all the elements of the installation have been installed correctly. 1. Data cabling has been pulled in correctly, away from power, without and kinks and twists. 2. The minimum of the exposed cable has been allowed for when terminating. 3. The cable is terminated in the correct format. 4. The modules are good and snugly fitting. 5. Without these steps done correctly, the structured cabling link won't pass. 
Finally, structured cabling testing shows that the materials used are to standard as well as the data cabling installation. Poor modules, panels, and cables will fail every time regardless of the quality of the installation. What is a fluke test in networking? Fluke is one of a few manufacturers of cable certification testers. The report below is from a fluke tester. Fluke makes a range of testers for structured cabling, fiber optic cabling, and coaxial cabling testing. What you should insist on from your data cabling test results. 1. That structured cabling testing is done with data cabling cable analyzer and not a cheaper mod tap tester. This is an example from a fluke tester. Without one of these test results per cable, you are taking a risk that your data cabling installation is not fit for purpose. Ensuring you'll receive these test results will give you confidence and peace of mind that your technology will work over the provided data cabling. For further assistance or a free survey, please email or call on the details below, and click like and subscribe if you have enjoyed this video.